Okay, let's go to Miss Carlson. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Cooking Miss Carlson. Today we have something with soy sauce and Worcester sauce. Hmm. Today we're going to be making uh, what we just call garlic noodles. Mm -hmm. um, these noodles go together very quickly. It's a, a nice kind of different meal that you can put together in, in a very short time frame. This is something that the kids usually don't eat either. So what happens is, because it calls for half of a pound of angel hair pasta, I didn't have angel hair either, so I'm using spaghetti pasta. Uh, I just go ahead and cook the whole pound up. So the kids usually eat spaghetti, and then we eat garlic noodles um, just to use up all the pasta in the box anyway. Okay, so you are going to need half of a pound of either angel hair pasta or spaghetti, uh, plain ramen, whatever kind of noodles that you have. You're also going to need about four cloves of garlic. I've got some of these really big cloves of garlic, so I'm just going to put three in. About five to six green onions. You need four tablespoons of butter or half of a stick two teaspoons of soy sauce, two tablespoons of brown sugar, one teaspoon of sesame oil, and then two tablespoons of oyster sauce. And you can get this just at any grocery store. I'm able to get this on grocery pickup. So it is something that's not uncommon. You can get it pretty, pretty easily. All right, so what you're going to do is start off by heating up your pan. Uh, if you have a wok, you could use that just a, a bigger skillet, you could even use a, a pot, whatever you have. Um, put your butter into your pan to get that melting. With the butter goes the garlic and the green onions. So while our butter is melting down, I'm just gonna squeeze the garlic in. Remember, I'm using three cloves of garlic just because my cloves are huge. Uh, if they were smaller cloves like this, I would use four. Because this is called garlic noodles, you want to have that garlicky taste. So you want um, that's you want your garlic to be pretty strong in this. All right, so we've got our cloves of garlic and our butter in our pan. This is sauteing. Um, I washed my green onions already. You want to make sure you do that. And then um, what I usually do is trim off the bottom, the very bottom of these, just to make sure that all the uh, dead ends are kind of clipped off. You will not use this part of the green onion. I just cut up until till you're not seeing the green anymore. That will be very strong. So you just want to use the ends. And you're going to cut these just kind of along the bottom. So you've got little tiny circles of green onion. Uh, we will use almost all of this green, green onion in our pan right now. We'll save a little bit to put on top as a garnish. I'm just gonna push our butter around so our garlic doesn't burn. Turn that down. Alright. I'm gonna put some of this in here. <coughs> our pan's getting kind of hot right now. Okay, so just cut off your green onions. We'll let this, the green onions and the garlic saute for about one to two minutes. While your onions and butter and garlic are sauteing, you can go ahead and make up your sauce too. Uh, so what, what you'll start with is just two teaspoons of soy sauce. Just put it into any, any bowl, just so you can mix all these things together. Two teaspoons of soy sauce. We need two tablespoons of packed brown sugar. So there's one. And two. We need a teaspoon of sesame oil. All right. You can get sesame oil from uh, just the regular grocery store as well. And two tablespoons of oyster sauce. This is pretty thick. Just shake it up a little bit. Just make sure you're sauteing your garlic and your onions kind of on a, a medium heat so that your garlic doesn't burn. Um, I do store this oyster sauce in the refrigerator. And same thing with the sesame oil as well. So once you use it, you will have to put it in the refrigerator. All 
you're going to do for the sauce then, just mix this up. This is what we're going to dump over our noodles. It's really honestly all there is to putting this together and it is so good. Okay, so that's what our onions, butter and garlic look like, just sauteed up a minute or two. And then we're just going to add in our pasta. Remember, I'm only using half of a box. The other half is being used for spaghetti. So about half of that. Dump our sauce over top. Stir it up and <laughs> you can put some of your remaining um, green onions on top as a garnish. That's it, your sauce and your garlic noodles are ready to go. There's the finished product. Thanks for joining us today.